I'm Hannah Fox and I'm a drummer. This is the Jan Skank House, which I thought was Shank, but this may be the original Brooklyn Skank House. I'm here to work with 20 some odd other drummers, percussionists, beatbox musicians, female, women, gender, something, and to play in the beautiful museum. My name is Kieran Gandhi. I am a drummer. I grew up here in New York. This is the oral history of female drummers with Tom Tom Magazine. I did my first one with them in 2012. And our idea was that for so long, women have been drumming and yet their history has not been celebrated. and They've been overlooked and silenced, which is ironic given that it's the drums. Today, we uh, recreate that history metaphorically. We each take different parts of the museum to play music. Being a female drummer is actually pretty awesome. It's been a lot of fun. I've gotten a lot of cool gigs by doing it. TomTom Tom Magazine is actually an awesome company. They have been an outlet um, for a lot of female drummers. I started TomTom Tom Magazine in 2009. It's the only magazine in the world about girl um, and women drummers. We are a quarterly magazine based right here in Brooklyn, so it's even nicer to be doing our event at the Brooklyn Museum. Drummers were selected based on the type of drums they play. We had congas, we had cajon, we had um, tabla and drum kit and beatboxing and um, SPDS digital drums. So we covered the gamut of what drummer means. And then we had um, a variety of just incredible women, different skill levels. Um, age levels, playing instruments. Tonight I was here performing throughout the Brooklyn Museum uh, with 20 different drummers over the course of two hours. I would go from drummer to drummer, have a percussive conversation with them. Um, we would share each other's story in that moment. I would take a bit of that information to the next drummer. I would spend roughly about three to five minutes with each drummer on all different floors from one to five. Everybody's looking at the art and it's hard to cut through the crowd, but I was just beatboxing some of the time when I would be walking in transition and people would hear me coming and naturally react and move out of the way and kind of also get a heads up like, oh, okay, this is where the beatboxer's at. We can follow her to the next performance. We're really just trying to change people's ideas around what women and girls can do and what anyone who feels like they can't do something can do. 